Welcome to this quick introduction to Freegal. Freegal is a service where you can download five MP3 downloads a week, and these are yours to keep forever and ever. Freegal includes a lot of popular music, mainly from the Sony label. You can get popular songs from the cast of Glee and bands like Oasis, Cake, or the Dave Matthews Band. There's also a large selection of classical music, comedy tracks, even speeches from politicians like Winston Churchill. There's also a wide variety of international artists that are included. To get started, open up your browser and go to our website, sjpl.org. Once you're there, click on the Downloads section in the middle to get started. This is where you get access to all of our different ebook as well as uh, e-magazines and e-newspaper collections. So in the middle, you'll see the link from Music from Freegal. Now, if you have an iPad or an iPhone or an Android phone, you should download the Freegal app and download uh, music directly to those devices. You will still need a valid library card, though. So once you're in the Freegal login screen, enter your full library card number. And you don't have to include any of the spaces that you see on your card. And then the next screen, screen enter your four-digit PIN. This is the four-digit PIN that you use when you check out materials using our self-checkout machines. In the bottom, if you click on any of these links, you can switch to the Spanish interface or the Italian interface. Now click Login. When you first log in, you'll notice uh, featured artists, featured albums, and also in the middle section, uh, your, the top 10 tracks from our library, the top 100 tracks from libraries across the United States, as well as top genres. So you can search by artist, song, album, or composer in this search screen here. But let's first look at the A to Z artist browsing option. One thing to remember is that any band or artist that begins with the word the will show up in the T's. So for example, the Beatles will be in the T's instead of the B section. You also see the genre listing here. And if you click on any of the uh, genres, you'll see different artists within that listing. So all of the spoken word options, um, comedy, entertainment, radio plays, speeches are in this area. Uh, you'll notice that there's also a soundtrack option. And these are soundtracks from popular music, uh, movies, but unfortunately they're not listed by movie. So you'll have to know something about the composer of different, um, different soundtracks to get started there. So you'll notice that there's, again, a huge variety of different kinds of genres as well as artists included. So let's go back to the home screen and do a quick search. I want to search for the artist Pink. And she spells her name a little bit uniquely with that exclamation point. So it's important to spell it exactly that way. And then let's click go. So if you click on the artist's name, it'll take you to a list of all of her albums. If you click on the album name, it'll take you to that album only. So right here in this screen, you can actually uh, click the triangle to play a sample of the track uh, or actually download the track. Uh, one thing to remember is that if you click the download now button, even if you press um, cancel afterwards, it'll use up one of your weekly downloads. And your weekly downloads will always show up in the top right here. You'll notice I've already downloaded two tracks this week. So let's go back to Pink and take a look at all of her different uh, albums. And let's say I want something from her greatest hits so far. Uh, you'll notice that uh, songs with explicit lyrics are marked as such. So again, let's um, play a sample. Uh, the samples are about 30 seconds long. And it's important to play a sample first so you know exactly what track you're downloading to make sure that you're getting exactly what you want. So when you click Download Now, you can click then Save File, say OK. And you'll notice that the weekly downloads limit will change automatically. Now the weekly downloads limit will reset every Sunday night at 9 o'clock. So after that, you can start downloading five tracks for that week again. And that's all there is to it. So 
I hope you enjoy this service. You can keep the downloaded tracks forever and ever, and they'll never expire.